Joined by UW Lacrosse head coach and players. Coach, we'll start with an opening statement from you, and then we'll take questions from the media. Oh, your overall thoughts on the game? Oh yeah, I think when you when you look at that game, that's two really good teams playing against each other. I mean, I I would, <laughs> I'd play that game every day if I could. Uh, you know, like, like that's what you love to have is you love to have that type of competition. Um, you know, obviously we didn't come out on top, but you know, like again, I just thought the atmosphere of that game. I thought the the players on the field on both sides are really good players. Um, I thought, uh, you know, Warburg's offensive staff made a really nice adjustment uh, at halftime, and they got us into unbalanced. And um, you know, they got us into an unbalanced three by one, and and you know, we they just caught us. They caught us in that one. We weren't able to get our corner over, and that's that's why he breaks the the long run. I think they had a really good game plan for their. Uh, for the running back on defense. And then obviously, um, you know, if you look at our offense and, and our offense going against them, it was every bit of what everybody talked about with their defense. And, and their front four was really good. Their rushing defense was really hard. And so I thought it was the game was kind of made up. To, it came out to be what I think everybody thought this game was going to be like. And I, like I said, I just uh, I thought it was an awesome environment. Um, I thought it was an awesome game. Uh, I would play that every day if I could. Um, it's just unfortunate we didn't come out on the, the winning end of it. I think Joey, Joey can too, but uh, you know, from my perspective, I, you know, I think we knew that was going to be like that. Uh, we knew we were going to have to kind of keep chipping away, chipping away, and hopefully we could break six or seven here and there uh, and just kind of keep it up. But, that, but that's what they've, they've done all year up front, and that's why they have, uh, I believe it was the best rushing defense in, in the country right now, or was it? I don't know what it is now, but I think it was up there. So, um, you know, they had a really good front four, they had a really good game plan uh, with their linebackers and, and the scrape over the top, and, um, you know, credit to them. Um, yeah, I, I just I didn't do my job. I just think that's really what it was. I just, sometimes you, the whole line, you know, makes a good running back, but sometimes a good running back has to do it himself sometimes too. So I thought they actually played pretty well, and I just have to make more people miss. So. Yeah, obviously it was really windy um, going the one direction. So when we were going that way, it was a lot tougher to throw. I just I thought they did a really good job of um, covering our guys. Not that our guys did anything wrong, but they just they they mixed up their looks. They did a good job of disguising. Uh, they picked me off twice. So obviously two mistakes. I wish I could take back, but. Yeah, it just it was tough going into the win, and then when we couldn't really get the running game going, it it um, just it wasn't our day, I guess, on offense. Can you put the season in perspective, and, and all you guys went through this year. I know you got the conference title and had a deep postseason uh, playoff hopes, and you kind of put the season in perspective. Yeah, obviously we wanted to go farther, but um, for me, it, it never was always about winning or losing. Um, I'll always just remember the fun things that we did together as a team. I think um, I'm so happy that I got super close with some of these guys, especially this season. I, I probably made a couple new, like really close friends that I just guys I wasn't close with. Um, so that, that's the kind of stuff I'll remember. Obviously, um, we wish we would have gone further, but I think 20 years from now, you know, I'll look back on my time here and be super satisfied with the way uh, we played and carried ourselves and the relationships I made. Like we won conference that that hadn't happened in a long time. Obviously, this sucks right now, but um, I wouldn't change anything. Uh, wouldn't change anything about my experience here. Ryan, what's been special for you this season? Uh, just being around the group of guys we have. Obviously, there's bare taste in the mouth right now after that one. It's a tough game, but just being around all the players, all the guys. I love these guys to death, and making the bonds and friendships that I've made will last a lifetime. Ryan, what did you see? I think the coach said they made a couple of good adjustments that kind of caught, off, caught us off guard, and we just weren't in the right spots where we needed to be as a defense, and that's on us. But yeah. Okay, how, does, how does a bad weather like this, or unusual weather, how does that change your game plan or, or your play call? 
<clears throat> yeah, like, like I was saying before, I, I just think when we were going against the wind, it was obviously tougher to push the ball downfield. Um, tried to do it once and got picked on it. So I just, I, I don't think it affected our overall game plan, but um, we needed to capitalize more when we did have the win. I think that was, that was our biggest problem is um, going three and out and stuff when we had the wind. Uh, can't do that when, when, it, when the weather is that <clears throat> much of a factor in the game. Coach, this seemed like uh, you know, every at this level, every team is good. But this seemed like to be a game worthy of maybe later down the road, like a quarterfinal or semifinal matchup. Yeah, but you know, didn't didn't work out that way. Uh, unfortunately, uh, like I said, you know, I think I think you're right. I think everybody kind of thought that, but uh, that's the way the Division Three is, and. Um, you know, unfortunately, it didn't work out for us. But we can't complain about that. I mean, I, I thought, you know, like I said, I, I think I just love the overall game environment of being able to play in this type of atmosphere and to get to play against a team like that. I think our guys, our guys love that type of competition. And I think, you know, that's really what we had over the last three weeks. And it's no different uh, today. So, um, yeah.